Hi, Henry here. Welcome to the sixth and final part of the Broken Arms, Broken Neck, Mended Heart video tutorial. So in this part, we're going to be doing the chords, which is actually probably um, the easiest section out of the whole song. So let's get started. So we start by barring the sixths, uh, fifth, and fourth strings uh, at the seventh fret. And then all that's going to happen here is you're going to hammer on with your ring finger onto the ninth fret of the fourth string. And from there it's just kind of a very you know, standard strumming pattern. Now this shape right here is going to translate to almost all of the uh, chords used in this section. So from this nine, I'm sorry, seven, seven, nine section. You're going to go to two, two, four. Then, this is the only oddity, but it's not that different. It's four, four, five. And five, five, seven. Now other variations, and I change it up every time I play because I haven't quite found the final version of it yet, but because I have this chord here, um, and the kind of the melodic content comes from that uh, the octave there, going from the 7 to the 9. But um, you can also kind of create uh, more of a sense of motion by, by hammering on with that pointer finger onto the base of those chords. Now I'm going to exaggerate it and use it in every chord just to kind of demonstrate that this can be done. Now another thing that I've been doing is hitting the 19th fret harmonics, which are, and kind of going alternating. So um, there are lots of variations. I haven't quite found the final version yet. I think Hiccup over here, where are you going? Yeah, she's apathetic. Um, will help me find the final version. So um, one more time through. up banging on the cajon again. <laughs> well, that's it. Now you've learned all of the parts that you need to be able to play Broken Arms, Broken Neck, Mended Heart. If you have any questions or if any of the videos weren't quite clear or if I went by too fast um, or if you know anything just wasn't very clear in the way that I played or explained it, by all means, please leave it in the comment section below. And uh, if there was a really big mistake, I'd be happy to make a new video to kind of fix any of the errors that I made, because uh, I'm sure that there are some. And uh, thank you so much for watching all of these videos. I really, really appreciate it. Uh, if you like what you see and want to see more, then you can support me by subscribing to my YouTube channel and giving a thumbs up to any of the videos that you like. So thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed the music and happy practicing.